guys, today this video is going to show you how to make this Mountain Dew soda bottle. For the soda bottle, I have Coca-Cola, PepsiCo, and today I'm going to make Mountain Dew. For this project, we're going to set our room as little V here and keep your red arrows point away from you. First, we're going to take one jelly green, start from first to second on your center, and two bands from first on your left to second on the center. And two bands, first to second on your left. Two bands, second to third on your left. We're going to repeat this step and do it on your right. Two bands, first on your right to second on the center. Two bands, first to second on your right, second to third on your right. And two bands from second to third on the center. Two more bands, third to fourth on the center. Now I'm going to use the darker green as a label. Now I'm going to use the darker green for the label. I'm going to use two bands, continue on here on your left, and do it for three times. Two and three. And we're going to do the same thing for the center and your right. Two bands of darker green. Two bands. Two bands. And two bands. This is the label. Now we're going to go back to the green color. I use jelly green. You can use other color if you don't have jelly green. And continue on here. And next, I'm going to use jelly Y for the bottle. I'm going to continue on here on your left and coming in here to the center. And do the same thing from the right, last one on your right, to last one on the center. And I'm going to take two more bands, continue on here on the center. This will work as bottle, part of the bottle. Now I'm going to use three white bands. This will be its cap, and I'm going to take one single white band, twist two times, so you see three rings here, press right here as a cap band. Now I'm going to press horizontal band for the first one, I'm going to use jelly green, the green color, make an upside down triangle, green color, upside down triangle, the label color, upside down triangle, single band, label color, upside down triangle, single band, label color, upside down triangle, single band, green color, upside down triangle, and this is what it should look like. Now I'm going to rotate our room and start looping. Reach under the cap band. This is three bands, so make sure you grab all three. Hold on to your cap band. You might want to use your finger to hold on to the band so you won't lose them. And then hook it to the next one on the center. Grab the bottom two, hook it to the next one. Next, we're going to look for these two bands. It should be the first two. This clear band is hard to see, so you can use your finger to bring it out. That way we'll make sure you grab the right band and hook it to your left and then next you're going to look for these two bands it should be the next two hook it to your right and then last two hook it to the center so here you will see three teardrops that means you grab the right band and now we're just going to do the regular looping just loop all the bands all the way to last one here. Stay inside horizontal band. Grab the bottom two. Look it to the next one. And now the last one here. I'm gonna grab it and hook it to the center here, from here to here. This is where these two bands come from. Now we're gonna come back here and 
Do the same thing on your right. Grab the bottom two, hook it to the next one. Bottom two, hook it to the next one. Bottom two, hook it to the next one. And just continue to do all the bends. Grab the bottom two and hook it back to the center here. There are many bends here, so we want to keep all the bends down. Now remember to come back here and finish up the center. Grab the bottom two, hook it to the next one, and just finish up looping all of them. If I'm going too fast, pause your videos and just loop all the bands. Now the last one, this is secure bands, only one. And then you just reach the bottom one, hook it to the next one here. This one is a secure band, so I'm just going to take it out. And you will have two bands here. Just grab one end through the others and pull it. And we're going to put it back here, temporary, just now, to hold it for us. That way when we pull in the band, this one won't come undone. Because this is jelly band, it's slippery. If you don't hold it, it will come out. And everything falling apart. Now, we just pull it out. And after you pull it out, this is secure band. We're going to hide it. Make sure you make it secure. This is a jelly band. If you use jelly band, it's slippery. You can use secret to crit on it. That way, we'll make sure double secure. And you just grab any bands close by and tuck it underneath so you hold it for us. Now it's a little bit messy, but that's okay. We can fix it. You just squeeze it in because we stretch a lot while we put in it. So that way it will look nicer. Now on the cap here, I'm going to take one single white band and drop it along. One. Twist it, drop it along one more time. So you make three loops here. And now after you're done here, we're going to press the labels on top of the label here. I'm going to use one red band and one green. So you just need to put your hook through here in the dark green area. Put it all the way through the other side. And take one red band and you can bring it through and hold on to the bands on this side and then put your hook through the low the label, the logo, it's kind of diagonally, not straight, so I'm going to do the same thing. Go up one, then that will look like this, diagonally across. Now I'm going to place another green band on top of the red one. So just put your hook next to the red and grab it through and the same, hold on to this end and then go up one to the other side and now we're going to grab this side through to the back here and that will look like a logo on the bottom this part is optional, you don't have to do this part if you have hard time doing it. I just thought this looks nicer. If you like these videos, subscribe, like, comment and share. Thank you for watching. See you next time.